Hey guys, you're watching Zoom and Lenny, my name is AJ, and we are back on another episode of Let's Build a City. And today we are on the east, north, east, south, west, <laughs> the west side of the city here uh, to build a football pitch. You guys have been nagging me and nagging me and nagging me to build a football pitch. And I thought, yeah, it's time. It's We should build one. Uh, we're right by the police station, which I think is a great idea. <laughs> you should always have a police station close by to a football pitch. And uh, like I did say, the football pitch here isn't going to, the stadium isn't going to be like a Manchester United or a Liverpool or a Chelsea sized stadium. Uh, think more Aldershot Town. <laughs> you know, think, think smaller. Um, I think we're going to go one more up. Uh, so yeah, I've done the pitch design, the pitch sort of size, and uh, it scales pretty well actually. If you imagine I'm in goal, oops, if you imagine I'm in goal, that's about the size of a goal. You know, if a goalkeeper jumps, he can usually hit his head on the post. You know, and he could dive. Ha! Ha! So it's a, it's a pretty good scale. And uh, it's pretty. the length is pretty good. It looks huge. It really does look huge. Uh, but I think it's okay. I think it's going to look good. I've got the penalty spots and everything like that. So for the goals, let's start off with the goals. We're going to obviously use spider webs. Now you can get spider webs in survival. Not a lot of people know this. You can now get these spider webs in survival by uh, getting a silk touch book, either enchanting it yourself, or you can find silk touch books in uh, dungeons in in spawners, and then putting them on a pair of shears. If you enchant them with a pair of sh onto a pair of shears, uh, they will actually become silk touch shears and you can collect spider webs with them that's about all you can really collect with the silk touch shears um, you know leaves and stuff you'll collect anyway so I think that's the design that we're gonna go for the goal now we could do the normal what I like to call the sort of schoolyard goal where it's more of a triangular shape like so uh -huh. uh, I mean spider webs like this is more of a sort of schoolyard goal um, but on normal like proper football pitches, they're more square and they're held up. They're held up by a couple of posts behind to get the net to get more square. So we're going to put those here. One, two, three, four, five, I think. And then on this side, how many? How far did they go out? Just one block wider. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. So if you imagine a piece of string that went from here, whoops. That went from there to there, it would hold that corner up, wouldn't it? So that's like a net, that's like, that's like a goal, that doesn't look too bad. And we'll do another one on that side. But, I've got some pictures here of Aldershot Town's um, football ground, football stadium, and their stands. And I think it's a really nice size stand for what we can do uh, for, for, for our sort of size. And I think we're going to use snow, maybe, mm, yeah, snow. And glass. I haven't planned this out really, but this is going to be for the um, for the managers' boxes, you know, where the uh, subs go and stuff like that. So um, maybe that size five wide would be good. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And we put this across the top, and then we put this across the top. Ah, ah, ah. Now, are these usually down a little bit? I think they are usually down just a smidge so what we're gonna do we're gonna get some um, those no uh, these ones I think if we get these ones we put those there and these there like that and then get some slabs down here like that and then I think if we just use full oak blocks eh, let's get some inventory space full oak blocks as benches here and then, where's my snow go? Snow and glass. If we put this back up here, like this, like this. And what we'll do is, as the city expands, we shall expand our football stadium. I think that'll be a pretty cool idea. And then let's put the glass behind here. Whoops. So yeah, once the city is absolutely massive, it'll be like we're in... Oh, hiccups. It'll be like we're in the Premier League, which will be quite funny, I think. And <laughs> I think that's going to be better, isn't it, to do? <laughs> Whoops! Like that. And I already need to sleep as well. I should always sleep before an episode. It's definitely something I need to start doing. So we're going to put these blocks back here. 
Okay, so there's one of the little hidey bits. Uh, one of the... Oh, and the top. And the top. There we go. So that's that's looking pretty cool. This is where they come down and they sit the managers and the substitutes and stuff like that. And they can see the pitch, pitch pretty well from here. You know, the managers stand out here and they go, Go on! Run! Man on! Man on! Etc, etc. <laughs> um, do we want the... I want the crowd... Do we want the crowd and the manager and, and the subs together? I think we should. We should really, shouldn't we? Okay, let's sleep away the night. Ah, whoops. Cobblestone wall. We will need normal cobblestone walls, not mossy ones. So let's get rid of those. Let's get cobblestone walls. And let's get some stone brick snow. Maybe our grey wool. That's our good sort of concrete block. Uh, what way am I facing? This way. Um... Yeah, and some of these stairs. Okay, so through the middle here, this is where our players are going to come out. They're going to come out through here. Um, and that's the back of that. So maybe we should have a bit of a space for play people to walk behind. Not much, maybe there. And our stands are going to start there. Now, let's just place that there. Now, on the flag on our town hall... Oh, while I'm over here, I'll just show you something else. On our town hall flag, our colours are light blue, dark blue, and white. So that's the colours of our football team as well. I did have a subscriber come on the world. The subscriber has built a house here, which is pretty cool. I like the ice windows. He's used wood. It's sort of the first real wooden house we've got on the um, on the on the world, which is nice. So I like that. I like that. He hasn't done the inside, but we've got a uh, a nice sort of swooping drive, right? Slightly curled. Got a nice path. Very nice wall. I like his wall that he's done here with jungle wood and jungle leaves. Yeah, and jungle leaves, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I like it. Very good job there. Very good job. So, back to getting the colours. We need light blue. Oh, no, that's cyan. We don't want that. I'll get confused with that. I don't like cyan. The cyan colour. Ah, purple. Go away. Uh, blue and white. There we go. So, they're going to be our stadium colours. Pretty good colours, I think. Yep. Back to the here. Now, hmm, this is going to be difficult to work out, but I think this is going to have to be, um, hmm, hmm, let's follow this around, follow this down, yeah, and then they're going to go along here, you're going to have to bear with me guys, bear with me for a moment, this is all going to be solid, this is all going to be solid concrete, and then we need another row of that like that and if we're going to have a cobblestone wall and we're going to need another one so a cobblestone wall is going to go down here to sort of hold the people in and stuff like that it looks like a a concrete wall do you know what i mean and then the stands are then going to start behind this we can sit up here we sit sort of up here that's pretty good that's pretty good it's not too far away from the pitch so let's um have we need some stairs up here as well uh hmm this is tough. It's tough to do. Let's have a stair there. And a stair there. And how many blocks do we want? Five. <laughs> there. One, two, three, four, five. There. Yep, 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 yep. And then we'll have blue first. Blue like this. And then this This is how we're going to do the seats. Because we haven't got stair. If we had stair wool, that would be cool. Uh, but we don't. So it's, um, we can't, <laughs> basically. Okay, so then we're going to have light blue, like that. And then a path. And then we'll have, oop, white. Okay, how does that look? That looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. Now, <laughs> the only trouble is, is anybody who's here doesn't have a great view. So do we make it higher? We could make it higher. Or, or even better... We take this away, and we put carpet on top instead. And I think that would be a better idea. Let's put carpet along here. Carpet like that. Get some string. Where's string? String. String. We put string along here. One, two, three, four, five. Because you can't see it too well. Like that. And then we can place carpet down on top of the string. Like so. I don't think we can now access in here. Oh, we can. We can still go in here, though, which is cool. Okay, so now when we sit on the bottom step, we can see the pitch. Great. Perfect. I like it. And they look cooler as well. I like those with a, a thinner roof on them. Okay, 
So we've got that. That's how the stadiums are going to go. Um, ooh, but we need enough room. We need to take that away. And then we need to... Hmm, how are we going to do this? We could take... We could do that, couldn't we? Do that, maybe? Yeah, that looks cool, doesn't it? Just to, to have a wall there, you see. And then the players are going to come through this space here. Uh, so that's going to start there again. Yes, pretty cool. Okay, let me get some stands in and uh, I shall be right back. That's actually turned out better than I thought. I like it. Uh, we just got a little bit more to do with these cobblestone walls. I've got the concrete at the front here. Ooh, egg. Um, on the pictures that I've been looking of, Aldershot Town's uh, football pitch, they actually have this giant or, or this larger area here for con with concrete uh, where people stand and they watch as well, as well as sitting. Uh, so we've got one, two, three, four, five seating rows. A, B, C, D, and E. Uh, i got them part down the middle here. Oh, I forgot to put these down here. Ha 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 ha. Do, 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 do. But uh, I want to hold this up with some cobblestone walls as well. Uh, because at the moment it looks like it's sort of magically hanging. And I don't like it when things magically hang. Hey, chicken. Are you the manager? You're the manager of Zono FC. <laughs> I like that name. That's just what we shall call it. Um, so, yeah, let's figure out where we're going to do this. Now, on the pictures, they actually do them like into the stands. And it looks really, really cool. So, I think we're going to go... Um, here. Let's just go along here like so. Boop. There we go. I like that. And then bring it down somewhere uh, in the middle probably. Right there. 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 And there. Okay, let's just have a look. Yeah, you can sort of see it. I'm not a huge fan of it. But it definitely adds something to it. So, um... We want another few of those down. Where is where did I line that up with? Okay, that one, which will be that one, and that one, and then that one. Okay, I shall do those later. But that's looking pretty cool. We've got the boxes where the managers go. We've got stairs that go up. In fact, would it be better if we all oh, if we just had that as well um no i don't think it needs it i think it's good like that but where are you going where are you going sweetie do you want to go out my dog wants to go out i think he's had enough with me go on then good boy oh, i'm sorry about that my dog wanted to go out he had enough of laying with me so uh i had to let him out and then he kicked the lead and the lead came out and i was like ah! but we're back we're all set up again uh, so yeah, we've done these stands. Now that's the only stands we're going to do. We're not going to do any at that end, that end, or that end yet. Only on one side. We're going to surround it by trees because trees are going to make this look really, really cool. Uh, but a couple of things. One, we're going to need a fence around the outside. Without having stands and stuff like this, we are going to need a fence, a perimeter fence all the way around. But first, we're going to need some light. So let's get some more cobblestone walls. Oops, I already had some on me. And how are we going to do this? Because they have big, big lights up in the sky. And I think if we use light grey wool, maybe. And see, I'll try my best to try and get some redstone lamps in there as well. But I think it might make it look a little bit odd. Now, I would like them in the corners. But that means they're going to be on a diagonal. But let's have a look. Let's have it like there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Nope. Uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That's a pretty good high. It's not quite as high as I want. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, yeah, that's, that's a better height. 20 high, that's what I know. And I know for the rest of them. So, uh, if we have that there, that there, that there. And there. Whoops. And there. And then if we go along, ooh, we could do it like that. Ah, 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 ah. Huh? Put these in here. Put 
that there. Put that there. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Just trying to think of if I can cover it up any way better. I don't think so, though. Not for the moment, anyway. And let's get some of this stuff. And we'll go along here. Like that. Oops. Ah! There. And there. And there. Ah! Get in the middle. No. There. Okay, let's just have a look down from the bottom here. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. It's not quite enough. I think we need another row of them. So we're going to have that there. That there. Ah, uh, we might be able to... God, I wish we had redstone blocks. That would really help in this situation. There. 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 Take those away. And then put these... We might be able to do something. I'm not sure yet. Just to get them all on and looking good. There. And then... See, these blocks don't need to be there now. But... That doesn't power that, which is really, really frustrating. If we had a redstone block, then we could do it. In fact, a lever might do it. A lever might do it. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yes. There we go. That gets rid of those redstone torches then. And we can easily hide these up with some more slabs. If we'd done slabs. Oops. Slabs there. And there. See? And we hide the levers up. Beautiful, beautiful. We can hide the rest the back of the lights uh, easy as well. Okay, I think that looks pretty cool as, as some lighting. And we should have four of those, one in each corner. Now, as far as the perimeter fence goes, let me have a look at some pictures. I think they've got a fence around it. They've got trees all around it. They have got a few more stands. They've got two stands. They've got, like, one there. And then they've got one there. And then they've got some sort of um, canopy there as well. Um... But we are going to need some some type of fencing on here, and we could just do a normal a normal fence like this. It's going to take ages to put down, absolutely forever to put down. In fact, but if we do three, uh, four, come on, four, five, high. That should be high enough that the ball wouldn't be kicked over over that. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that should be high enough. That's a nice height for the for the fence. Have that all the way around, and then have trees around that and stripe the stripe the pitch. We definitely need to do that. It's very dark in here. Maybe we can light this up in here with just some glowstone. Oops, just some glowstone in here. I hear my dogs growling. I hope you can't hear that. Or quite as easy, at least. I hope not. Um, right. Where, where's that other one? Oh, yeah, here. There. <sighs> Uh -huh. Just put that there. One, two. Uh, there, isn't it? Does that light up enough in there? That gives us a nice light. We could do some more lighting in there. Okay, we'll figure that out. But I think I'm going to have to go off camera while I place down this huge fence all the way around and these lights. Because that fence is going to be ever so boring to do. It'll take ever such a long time. So, uh, I shall be right back. Alright, I'm just placing down the stripes now. Got all the fence down and got all the lights. I'll show you them in a minute. Uh, but I just thought, because it, all of this episode has pretty much been off camera, and I've just sort of done progress updates, I thought I'd come back and chat to you for a little bit uh, with some ideas that I've got for the city. So uh, a lot of you were saying racetrack, build a racetrack. And I want to build a racetrack. I really want to build a racetrack. But racetracks are massive. Massive. If any of you have ever been F1 racing or or, or not like driven them, but uh, yeah, uh, got to watch them and touring car racing and stuff like that, or NASCAR if you're in the um, states or whatever. Um, they're big tracks, and I think I think that they're a little too big for our city. Four, five. There we go. Um, so I was thinking, well, we can still do one, but instead. We'll do a go-kart track. Now, I've been go-kart racing before, and I love go-kart racing. Really, really fun. Um, with the little twin-engine ones and stuff like that. We could probably do a go-kart track. And we can probably, if we're creative enough, 
we can probably come up with a, a, a go-kart in Minecraft. Like, not one that moves, obviously, but we can make one look like a little go-kart. I think that would be pretty funny to do. So, um, I'm going to look into some designs for that. Now, this football stadium is actually coming out a lot better than I thought it was going to. I didn't think it would look as good as this. I thought it was going to be a big struggle uh, to build a football stadium. So, it's actually given me confidence to do other sports-related things. And I was thinking of baseball. Uh, what would you call it? Not baseball court, are they? What would you call them? Baseball stadium? Are they called stadiums? I think they're called stadiums. A big baseball stadium. Now, I, you don't really get baseball in the UK too much at all, really. Baseball isn't really that popular. Um, I've never seen it on TV. Um, I think you play a similar version to it at school. We call it rounders at school basically um, but the, it's a similar sort of process of of reaching certain points around the the pitch uh, but I think a, a baseball pitch would look amazing because of the shape that they are uh, if you ever get a lighting glitch see this lighting glitch on the floor on this wool it's slightly darker and you see that if I back up a little bit if you place a block on top of it and then break it it goes away so that's a little tip for you um, but yeah I think because of the shape of a baseball pitch or baseball stadium, it would be really cool. They're sort of square pitched, but then they sort of almost look triangular. And I think in Minecraft, potentially, we could make it look really good. Now, I would prefer to have stained clay. The um, orange stained clay would be a perfect colour for it, uh, rather than orange or brown wool. Uh, in this texture pack, but we don't have clay as of yet. You never know. What we might do is we might wait and uh, see when Xbox One Edition comes out if we have clay on it or not. I have been hearing some rumours about Xbox One. I'm not going to say anything about them because I haven't had any hard proof. If I get any hard proof about uh, Minecraft, Xbox 360 or, or PlayStation or Xbox One News or anything like that, then I, I will let you guys know, but it has to be confirmed. It has to be solid. It has to be <laughs> in more than one location. Um, so yeah, if, if anything news-wise does come out about stained clay or anything like that, then uh, I shall let you guys know. Uh, what else was I going to say? Oh yeah, about this football pitch. Um, I know I have a lot of very um, football, big football fanatics. Uh, I know a lot of you subscribers are football fanatics. And... You're probably not going to like this pitch too much. You are going to want an absolutely massive Manchester United pitch. I did say a while ago that we just can't do a big Manchester United pitch straight off the bat on here. Um, it would just be too much work. The cathedral took so long to do. This football stadium has actually taken longer than I thought to do. Um, I didn't think it would really take this long. The stands took an awful long time to do. Um, so it will get there. What we're going to do is we're going to upgrade this stadium as the city upgrades. So sort of how I done the how I built the cathedral, how I done like updates for you guys now and again. I would uh, I would go over to it and show you how it was progressing until it was fully completed. And uh, I'll probably do the same here. We shall get the football stadium how it is now and just grow up. By the way, here's the fence and all the lights. Looking pretty cool, I think. Uh, oh, and this is how I covered up the back of the lights in the end. I think that looks pretty cool. It looks pretty neat, doesn't it, I think? Covers all the redstone up. Um, so, yeah. Uh, what was I say? Yeah, as uh, we go through episodes, if I have time off camera and stuff like that, I will build more stands. I shall build more parts to the map, uh, to, the, to the stadium, you know, more seats and stuff like that. And I will give you guys updates whenever I do that. So whenever I add another stand, I shall bring it over and show you guys, you know, and uh, show you how it progresses. But it's quite, it, it'd be quite a good idea to sort of have a progressive uh, map like this with a football pitch. Because a city this size isn't going to have a massive football pitch, is it? It's going to have a very small p football pitch, more of a training ground. And then it sort of gets bigger as we go. As we climb up the divisions as our football team gets better, <laughs> we'll be able to make a bigger stadium. And eventually, I do hope to have a huge, huge stadium. One, two, three, four, five. I do hope to have like a huge stadium with a sort of rounded pitch and a uh, uh, rounded stadium. Do you know what I mean? How they're like oval with a big oval in the sky and it's all enclosed in with a roof. I think that would be awesome to have. 
Uh, it's just going to take a little while to do. So uh, anyway, I'm going to get back to doing this green strips on the road. This is going to take so long on the road on the pitch. This is going to take absolutely forever, but I'll get there. What I do for you guys, huh? All right, be back in a minute. And through the power of editing, it is done. Let's have a look. Huh? Yeah. Pow. Pitch looks amazing, doesn't it? I think that looks really good. The stripes definitely were worth it. Uh, they definitely add something to it. They break up the sort of pitch from the um, around the outside. Something that we do just need to do very, very quickly is uh, one, put some trees down. We need to put the trees down, but we'll put those down last in a minute. We just need to make this uh, maybe some other block. Maybe stone would be better. Yeah. So we'll put some stone down here. Yep. As we go through the, um, what would you call this place? I don't know what you would call it. What would you call it? The uh, walkway? I don't know where they come out from. We do need a building on the back here. I won't be doing it today. Uh, this is what the back looks like, by the way. Got some colours in there. Um, we do need a back on here, though, definitely, because we need the changing rooms you know we need we need the the trophy room and the changing room and stuff like that it doesn't have to be a big building just a building on the back here we'll do that eventually something i have noticed is we've got holes holes here so we'll probably cover those up with some some slabs boop 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 like so i'll do the other side later on today but there's that done uh, covered up those holes. We just need some trees down here now to surround the area. Oop. Okay, this is looking pretty good. This isn't looking too bad. Oops. Now down the other side, down this side of the pitch, we're going to need a car park. We're going to need somewhere for the people to park. Not a huge one. I mean, not City car park or not City stadium doesn't have an absolutely massive car park. Um... Obviously, I live by Norwich. Um, I don't like that big tree there. Oh, well, it doesn't matter too much. That's pretty good, though. I like that. A little bit of greenery around here. I have no idea what it's going to look like on the map. Let's have a look and see. Oops. Let's have a look and see what it looks like on the map. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's pretty big. Isn't that weird how it, how the um, the dark green is sort of coming up in a, a grey sort of look? Very, very strange. I like it. You can definitely know that it's there for sure. That's pretty cool. That is huge though, isn't it? That takes up a huge part of the map. But that definitely looks pretty cool. But I think we need to leave it there, guys. So uh, if you enjoyed the episode, then hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And we shall see you in the next episode. Bye!